been a, about a day or so since I saw the video that little me, little, uh, that little motherfucker me, little me put up. Right quick, it's kind of hard to say, even in comments, without sounding like you're talking about yourself, man, but it's a good way to keep your name in someone's head, man, little me. Little me, or a little you me, or a little me you, or a little us me, or a little me us, or a little me me, or uh, man, you know, fuck it, man, it's, a, it's all out of respect, me, you know who I'm talking about, shit, but since I saw this video that Little fella shared out, and I saw it. And then uh, I verbally conversed with little fella. He is a little fella. <laughs> I ain't making fun, guys. I ain't making fun. Just, just my my way of doing shit. But anyways, Seth, damn it, boy. That's some, I mean, you've preached to me when we've been on live together. you preached private messages together about loyalty, trust, doing what's right. And I mean, and every time you got a little sideways in your feelings about some shit that's happening, and I'm trying to talk to you, calm you down a little bit, you always said, maybe I'm just too real for YouTube. Talking about yourself. Talking about you as a little too real for YouTube. And then to find out you've done that shit, man. Or you was involved in that shit. That's fucked up. Now, is everybody on YouTube perfect? No. There's not a perfect person on YouTube. But to do somebody like that, and uh, it's, man, I, I can't, I can't, no, I can't, I can't walk that path with you, brother. I can't. I can't do it, man. I can't back you up on something that behind the scenes, behind the curtain, snake ass shit, man. So I wanna, all right, it. Little me, which he said in the video today that he wasn't doing that to get shout outs. He wasn't doing that to get his subscriber count up. He wasn't doing that to get views up. Nothing like that. But dude, hell, man. Like I commented before, man, I appreciate and respect you for keeping it real. And bringing that shit to light. And I also want to appreciate you, man. Little me. Little motherfucking me. Every live that you're in, every live you're in, you spend the majority of the time posting people's YouTube channels and telling other people to go subscribe to them. And there was one time, a couple nights ago, I was trying, I was doing that shit for other people. 
Man, that's a, that's a fucking job. That's a fucking job, man. That is a fucking job. Because you, I don't know how you do it. Keep up what's going on in the comments or going on in the on the live panel. Because hell, I was doing that shit. I did about four or five of them. And I'm like, well, fuck. What was he saying? I had to back the fuck up. Hell, the live was over 45 minutes. I was still watching the son of a bitch. <laughs> man, I, I appreciate the hell out of that, man. You, you go out of your way for other people, man. It, can't ask more than that. Little fella, you the same way, man. You, you can call us the backside of the pillow. And, uh, hell, little Tony, little motherfucking Tony Lamont, you lemon dodging son of a bitch. Damn, where were you at when I was on the damn junior high team playing dodgeball? I needed your ass on our team. He's dodging in lemons like a motherfucker. Shit. Dodging lemons, fruits, food, people, horses, crabs. Damn, dodge it all. <laughs> man, you cool as fuck, man. I mean, all you guys, man. <clears throat> I mean, yeah, Seth brought me into the little fold of you guys and whatever. Show me around. Introduce me to everybody. It's all cool. But, hell, y'all cool group of guys, man. All the little motherfuckers. Anybody's got a little motherfucker in their name, man. I mean, I did it at first out of respect for you guys and show support. And then I was getting people messaging me, asking me what that was all about. It's kind of confusing that being on my name and all that shit. So I'm like, yeah, it is kind of confusing. I, you know, I've been just Carolina Cowboy forever. So I took it off. And then a bunch of shit started going down. And I'm like, you know what? I'm going to put it back on there, man. I'm going to put it back on there. I mean, I'm, I show support to you guys. You guys supported me. Not only just in your words and your actions. Spreading the word and all that shit, man. Red Eyed Patriot. All you guys, man. Uh, Bird. She, she's been cool as shit. And I mean, I like going to all y'all's lives. I like going to Sin's lives. Triple T's lives, he, he keeps it fucking 100 every fucking time, man. Like going to their lives and all that and hanging out with little fella, little me, little Tony, going to little Tony's lives, he's cool as shit. All that shit, but I like going to little Bird's channel, her lives, because, man, it ain't constant fucking drama. It ain't, uh, it's just laugh, cut up, chill, and just talk about shh. Hell, we can talk about insurance policies for an hour. It's just relaxed. Just cool as hell. But I just want to do that little thing there just to you know, I, I support the little MFs. I support San TV. Tony Lemon, Lehman, Lemon, Lemon, whatever his name is. His last name, however you say it. I mean, there's a lot of people that I can holler out, which, hell, I ain't no, big sub carrying account, nothing like that, but, I mean, I've got nothing but respect to all of y'all. And from all of y'all. And like I said, I've got support from all of y'all. And it just, you know, that shit, that shit goes a long way. But last but not least, I want to say this last little bit, more importantly, I guess you'd say, Poker Mike. How the fuck? How in the fuck can 
somebody do Poker Mike the way he's been done. Is beyond me. He has been nothing but respectful to everybody. No matter whose live he's in or whose live he's on panel with, he has been respectful. He's been honest, straightforward. of anybody that comes into the, the chat, anybody that comes on the panel. How the fuck can someone do him the way he's been done? Poker Mike, my, my heart, my prayers, my thoughts are sending good vibes, all that shit. Sending that straight to you, my man. And Poker Mike, you're like, you're like pop to everybody out here. Man, we all respect you. Enjoy your company. Mm -hmm. yeah, you're just an all-around good guy. But, unfortunately, there's some people out there that sees somebody that's got a big heart. See somebody that wants to do for other people. They see somebody that wants to go out of their way, make sacrifices to make sure somebody else has what they need, has what they want, and they go at him like a goddamn vulture. And I'm sorry you had to go through that shit, my man. You know what? You a strong motherfucker. You'll see yourself through all that shit. You'll get through it all. I'm pretty sure, just from the short time I've known you, you're not one of them people that allow somebody to burn your ass more than once. So I hope the video that little motherfucking me put out, the video that little Vela shared of little me talking on some of that shit is spread and shared throughout so everybody will know about that shit and let you know that not only the little MFs got your back poker mic the real ones I got your back a lot of motherfuckers got your back Pokemon.